Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanted to show you how to change Twitter display colors here on twitter.com. Now, this is not yet available on the mobile app when I'm making this, but I'll show you exactly where to find it there too once it appears there. But you could basically change the color here from the default blue here to all these other selections like purple and green. And that will change your tweet option here, the color and a bunch more like the hashtags will display in a different color too. And you also have background colors. Now you have two different dark modes. You have a lights out dark mode, which is completely black and a dim mode and your default white. So let me show you where to find this here. And if it's your first time here, I make these type of videos every single day of the week. So please consider subscribing. Let's jump into the homepage here and we wanna make sure we're logged into our account first. So once you log in, you could come to more here and then go to settings and privacy, click this. And on that page, you wanna jump down under general and you should see display. This is where you could also change your font size, but you could also change the color and the background dark mode that I showed you a second ago. So if I chose purple here, now if I go back to the homepage, you could see things are showing up as purple, even hashtags show up as purple over here throughout your Twitter. Once you get this in the mobile app, you just have to press the logo on the top left here to come to settings and privacy option, press settings and privacy, and then press display and sound. And once you're on this page, you have dark mode right now available. So you could choose your dark mode from dim to lights out. And as soon as you activate dark mode on top, it will take over or you could use your device as setting here on the iPhone, for example. So it will turn into dark mode in my case at night. And let me go back and you could change your font sizes, but you cannot change theme colors just yet on the mobile app. As soon as that is available, I'll update this video. But right now you could do so on twitter.com. I hope you found this quick video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for easy to follow social media and tech videos. And I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.